Hi, I'm Dr. Michael Marshall from Veterinary Wellness Center in Boise, Idaho. And today I'm going to talk about mange in dogs. Mange is basically mites that live down in the skin. And I'll start by showing you a video. So a little disclaimer here is that if you don't like creepy and crawly things, don't watch this. And also, it's a little poor quality because it's tough to film inside a microscope. Take a look. See those guys? Yeah, kind of gross. So those are Sarcothes scabii. It's a type of mite that lives down in the skin. It can be picked up from another dog that's infected. It can even be picked up from wildlife if they're in the area like a coyote or a fox that may leave some hair. Pick it up that way. And what happens is they burrow down the skin and they cause a very intensely pruritic, which means itchy condition, and the hair will start falling out. So the way we diagnose it is we do what's called a skin scrape, which as it sounds, we scrape the layer of the skin off, check it out, look for them under the microscope. The thing is, that sometimes they're tough to find. So I was always taught by a seasoned practitioner that if you see an older dog that's suddenly itchy, losing hair, treat him for mange. And the good news is it's actually fairly treatable. There's various ways we can do it, and the ways are improving all the time. So mainly dogs are infected by this. Cats can get it if they're immunocompromised, and actually a, a word of caution is that people can too. They can get a rash on their arms, but that's not my realm. If you have an itchy dog and you're getting itchy, go see your physician, but please come see us. So that's the rundown on scabies. Thank you for watching. Please like us on Facebook.